Hey guys. Hola, bienvenidos a mi canal. Um, if you're new to my channel, uh, if you're new to my channel, what? Oh, shut up. Hola, bienvenidos a mi canal. If you're new to my channel, um, my name is Cassie and I post videos. Why am I always heavy fucking breathing? Let's try that again. Hola, bienvenidos a mi canal. Um, my name is Cassie, if you're new to my channel. I post videos about makeup, um, lifestyle, um, just pretty much anything that I want to about my life, um, my relationship, vlogs, just kind of whatever comes to my mind, whatever inspires me. So today, today's video is going to be my April favorites. Um, so if you guys can tell or if you guys know, if you live in this world that we live in currently, um, we're in the midst of a pandemic. Um, we've been since the end of, or the middle of March, and now we're in April. Um, so, now we're in the end of April. So we've kind of been going through this for about a month and a half already. Um, so you would think that I don't really go out not putting makeup on, and majority of these things aren't makeup um and i don't have that much to talk about just because obviously i've been kind of cooped in my house i haven't been really getting ready or actually i have been but just to film tip talks <laughs> besides the point a uh, majority of these things are not makeup related um they're just things that i have been loving even beyond april this is why this is why i rant about unnecessary shit and this I edit literally majority of all this shit gets edited out <sighs> I could ramble I've actually been rambling for the past five minutes um you haven't seen majority of it just because I cut it out because I fucking talk too much um but uh what else was I going to oh yeah if you haven't yet if you're new to my channel or if you haven't subscribed please subscribe to my channel i don't know what you're waiting for this is the most entertaining channel on youtube um no but in a serious note um subscribe to my channel i would love for you guys to join my little family it's growing it's thriving slowly but surely um and i'm really excited so i would love to gain some more supporters gain some more people to join the fam and um also hit that bell just so you're notified every single time that i do post a video um i am on a schedule right now um every sunday i do post a new video so you can always come check my channel on sunday um but that might change that might not i don't know right now we're sticking to sundays because that's obviously working for me so we'll do that for now but yeah hit that subscribe button hit that bell and don't forget to like this video if you like it or if you like videos like this and i will be sure to continue to do that for every single month but without further ado because like i said i can continue to ramble about really irrelevant shit um let's jump in to the video so my first favorite is going to be a mason jar with ice and water mm. and these reusable straws from amazon really i think a majority of my video i have one of these and i'm sipping on one of these if you know you know but yeah i just get these big ass i think these are not the pints the half gallons the ha the quarts these are the quarts i don't know my sizes but this is like the bigger ones um and these straws are like perfect for them um i got these straws on amazon you just click in reusable straws they have an assortment of them i just bought um i think i was like a pack of 20 for like seven dollars and i absolutely love straws if you're like me then you would know that's not included in my favorites i was just joking but honestly i think we should all invest in some reusable straws it comes with a little like um i guess cleaner to cleaner brush to clean the inside of the straw 
um and yeah i think that we all need to do our part in eliminating the use of plastic no more water bottles no more solo cups no more plastic plates plastic forks no more of that shit let's eliminate it no more plastic bags no more plastic okay let's take care of our earth because our earth takes care of us the next favorite is going to be something that i have been low-key addicted to the past um i don't know month because since i am not working currently um i actually got laid off from my job because their the business is really slow due to covid19 um so i was laid off temporarily until i guess all of this subsides but i have all this time on my hands um not only have i been filming a lot of youtube videos and catching up on editing and making sure that i'm you know caught up with all my sunday videos um i have been playing a lot of switch and the games that i've been playing it's not animal crossing it's none other than mario kart so i've been playing mario kart um deluxe and i absolutely bought love bought i absolutely love this fm game um i bought it solely i bought the switch solely well my husband bought me the switch but solely because i wanted to play this game i've been playing this game since i can i can't even remember since i was a youngin 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 um i just remember this game when i was little so it's just very nostalgic but it's also super fun to play me and my husband play on the big tv or i'm just laying in bed just playing by myself um i like to you know um follow the stories and like you know get all the stars and get all the trophies trophies for every one of the what are those called i don't know like you know it has the 50 cc's 100 cc's 150 i want to get it for all of them um obviously the higher the number the faster you go and the harder it is so it gets frustrating i have to turn it off after a while but honestly this is probably the most entertaining game that i have um i haven't got my hands on animal crossing i don't know if i want to i'm not really a gamer this is just fun because it's not like comp I guess it's kind of competitive, but it's, well, if you're playing against people, but when you're playing alone, it's more of like an achievement type of stuff, like a goal that you want to reach. I'm not really of like competitive just because it gives me so much anxiety and I end up losing for that reason because I have so much anxiety about like winning. So yeah, this is just a fun game to play with the family, with a group of people. If you have someone else that has a Switch, you can combine all four, um, controllers and it splits it in four screens and all four of your plane which i think is pretty fucking awesome um so yeah that is a game that i'm currently obsessed with and it's one of my favorites here in april the next um favorite is going to be something that looks really disgusting right now just because i have used it um non-stop but um it's a hair product and it's the shea moisture Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthened and Restore Anti-Breakage Spray with Shea Butter and Peppermint. Um, it is this bottle. It's literally almost empty. I had it for a while. Um, I would say I really, 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 really like this um, product. I put it on on damp hair like right after i get out of the shower i let my hair dry a little bit and then i just um add it i don't have it on today today this is like second day hair so i don't like to put on second day hair just because i've noticed my hair gets a lot sticky and oily with this product but out of the shower it um honestly really makes my hair look really good doesn't make it frizzy makes it like nice and soft and not like crunchy and hard like hairspray or mousse does so i really like this stuff and i will be repurchasing this because i am literally almost done so i don't wash my hair every single day um and i don't sleep with like a hair head wrap or anything so when i wake up my hair is frizzy and crazy so i have to re-wet it re you know set it but if i had like mousse or hairspray in my hair before my hair is going to be sticky and it's going to be crunchy and it's not going to look cute it's not going to be easy to manage i guess um so today this is my second day hair like i said and it's my first time using it on second day hair i've only used it on um fresh wet hair and i absolutely love the way it left my hair my hair is so soft 
it has a little bit of crunch to it but that's just to hold and i know it's the dirtier your hair gets the little bit of crunch like this this is like really soft and all i did was wet my hair and apply a little bit more of this product and i'm just absolutely in love with it and i can just stop talking and tell you what it is um it is also from shea moisture and it is the coconut and hibiscus curl enhancing smoothie with silk protein and neem oil neem oil neem oil neem oil it has no sulfates, no parabens, no mineral oil, no testing on animals, and no petroleum. Um, so yeah, it works so good on my hair. It left my hair so nice and soft. Give it up to this thing. This thing right here. I wish that I can articulate myself a lot better. But I don't know. I don't know. Let's just go on to the next one. So my next favorite is going to be something that you guys see me use here on this channel multiple times. And I think I mentioned it before, but it is the Vaseline Lip, Lip Therapy, specifically the rosy pink one. Okay, my camera. My camera just want to effing um, focus on it. But it's this honestly tiny ass little thing. Look at my head, look at the little thing. It is a small little um, lip balm and I absolutely love it. I was looking in the market, I was in the market looking for a chapstick that left my lips shiny and not like those chapsticks leave your hair, your lips kind of like with a white cast on it. I don't know if that's just me and my lips, but my lips stay fucking dry for some reason and this shit oh my god i can't there's not a day that goes by that i do not put this right as i wake up and right before i go to bed like i am obsessed with this little thing it comes in a two pack for like five bucks i believe and i always keep one in my purse keep one here on my makeup desk just so i always have one when i need it and i absolutely love this you guys need to get you one because it honestly especially if you suffer from dry lips um cracked lips things like that um and you want a shiny look just so you don't look super like washed out with that like overcast um, of a chapstick definitely get you one of these guys so the next one of my favorites for the month of April um, is going to be this Olay luminous whip and this has um, SPF 25 so that's good a moisturizer with SPF you couldn't ask for more but I absolutely love this moisturizer i have combination to oily skin more oily than dry so um i just thought like oh well my skin doesn't need any more moisture it's super oily but on the contrary if your skin is dry the more oil or if you don't provide any like moisture to your skin the more oil it's going to process um it's going to develop so you want to add moisturizer and the more moisturizer the more luminous you are yeah, just the more moisture that you give your skin, the less of your natural oils it's going to produce. So my skin hasn't been that oil, which is actually really crazy and really good because I fucking hate it when my skin gets so oily and my makeup starts slipping around and it looks really fucking gross. So, um, yes, I really love this one. It's honestly really good. So I'm glad and once I run out, I'm going to repurchase this again. So thank you very much and the last thing that i have to share today is going to be a concealer and the concealer is going to be this la girl pro conceal hd high definition i hate you camera um it's this guy right here so this guy is um just your average concealer for under your eyes all your highlight your peak points one it's like 5.99 i believe 4.99 hella cheap hella inexpensive you can find this at target you can find this at walgreens you can find this at walmart you can find it on amazon you can find it on literally anywhere you go besides sephora fuck you sephora just kidding besides sephora you can find this concealer and i absolutely love the way it looks i'm wearing it today underneath my eyes i don't know if you guys can tell let me get a little closer i'm wearing it today underneath my eyes on my nose on my for the center of my forehead and on my chin and i just love the way it makes my under eyes look super um if i didn't set it with powder it's super like luminous and um very hydrating in my opinion and it just does a good job of covering and it just makes your eyes look very like 
blown out like i don't even know how to explain it almost like cartoony like just perfection it just makes my under eyes look so nice it doesn't crease but i also set it so if you don't set it i don't know if it's going to crease on you probably just because it's super hydrating but if you have a dry under eyes try using this i absolutely love it it's so inexpensive so even if you buy it and you don't like it you're not really going to be losing that much money um because it's not that expensive so yes this is definitely one of my april favorites and i have been using it i'm almost done and i have well i have a cart going on ulta right now i haven't purchased yet but um this is in my cart currently um i will be repurchasing a new one okay and that's gonna be all for my april favorites thank you so much if you made it this far in the video <laughs> If you did, please make sure you give this video a thumbs up just so I know that you like these type of videos. And I will be sure to do one for May. And leave a comment down below letting me know what's your favorites of April. What have you been using? What products? What games? What hair products? What makeup products? What drinks? Anything. What you've been liking the month of April. I'm obsessed with. Um, oh, i also been obsessed with TikTok. I never thought I would say that just because I thought TikTok was so corny and cheesy, but <laughs> I'm obsessed. Um, but anyways, follow me on all my social medias. I will have them down below somewhere, maybe right here, maybe right here, I don't know. I will have them there. They'll also be on the descriptions with links. Follow me there because I do put updates. I do ask questions when I do Q&As. Um, and yeah, you guys can participate on that stuff. Um also what else did i want to say oh yeah follow me on tiktok i'll leave that there as well and um i think that's it don't forget to subscribe um because it really supports my channel i would love for you guys to join the fam and i post videos every sunday so don't miss out on that and like comment subscribe follow me on my social medias um but yeah i can like i said i can rant i've been ranting this whole video so let me just shut up and thank you so much and i will see you guys next sunday bye